Hey guys, how's it going? Now, we all love using our smartphones to browse the internet and chances are, if you're using an Android device, you're probably just using Google Chrome. But let's be honest, it's not the best option out there. It hogs up memory, slows your phone down, tracks your data, and honestly, it doesn't even come with any extra features that make your mobile web browsing experience any better. So what's the best alternative? Well, I've got seven for you. This is one from Guiding Tech, and in today's video, we'll be taking a look at the top seven web browsers that you can use on your Android device. Now, these are all unique, protect your privacy and come with plethora of features. So without wasting any time, let's just jump right into it. All right, so kicking things off, I did mention Chrome alternatives, right? And what's better than Bromite, especially when you have privacy in focus. Bromite is built using Chromium, so you get the same UI here, but with ad blocking and privacy enhancements. While it has a pretty solid ad filter, you can add your own filters too. Additionally, the browser disguises your user agent, which basically means that websites cannot identify your device. It comes with an always on incognito mode and supports a full configuration of proxies for enhanced privacy protection. Now, if you're looking for a full on complete browser loaded with features, one of the best browsers that I've personally come across and still use on a daily basis is Soul Browser. Soul Browser comes with a clean layout with a plethora of features to choose from. There's a smooth one handed mode, a dark theme, a screen filter, automatic translation of the text, a capable data saver mode, and a pretty solid download manager too. Also, speaking of downloads, the browser can automatically download images and videos from the websites you visit with just a couple of tabs. It can also be used as a solid PDF viewer. And as for the UI, it's fully customizable as per your liking. In fact, if I had to sum it up, it's kind of like Vivaldi for Windows, cause not the Android version, Vivaldi for Android is not that good. But yeah, Vivaldi on Windows is amazing and Soul Browser is kind of like that, especially in terms of customizability. But that reminds me, if you're looking for a web browser on your Windows PC as well, make sure to check out our video from here on the same topic. All right, so moving along, another feature-rich browser that a lot of folks, including me, love to use on on their Android device is Stargun Browser. Stargun opens up as a simple to use web browser with a clean UI, but has so many features underneath. You get a pretty good ad blocker, support for various different gestures, a reader mode, and much more. There's also support for using your own fonts here, which is pretty cool. However, my favorite part is the image and video downloader here. You can open a web page and then just tap on these options and the browser will automatically detect all the images or videos on the page, allowing you to easily download them. Moving on, if you want a Chrome alternative, but with added features, my go-to recommendation is Kiwi Browser. Kiwi uses Chromium as a base, but offers plenty of useful features. It includes native ad blocking, a pop-up blocker, a night mode with 100% contrast mode for AMOLED screens. You can also reposition a lot of the UI elements to suit your liking. Now sure, you can't sync your Google account data from your PC directly, but for what it's worth, Kiwi is an excellent browser. Next up, if privacy along with speed is what you're after, Brave Browser is something that a lot of users will vouch for. It's one of the most secure and snappy browsers for your Android device. Brave comes with a free built-in ad blocker and pop-up blocker, along with a script and 3D party cookie blocker as well. You get the benefits of private browsing while still having your history stored securely if need be. Brave enforces HTTPS everywhere, and in terms of speeds, it's one of the fastest browsers out there. What's more is that Brave does not use up a lot of resources either and is good for entry-level Android devices too. Speaking of lightweight devices, you have to check out Via Browser. It's one of the best browsers for lightweight devices. Via Browser is super lightweight, coming in at just 1.6 MB. It has a super clean and minimal UI. There are no ads or news or random things that get thrown on your screen. Just a simple to use UI that works fluidly and is quite fast too. But don't be deceived by this. You still get plenty of features like a night mode, data saving, translation, and much more. Vaya is easily the best browser for everyone since it can run on any smartphone out there, be it entry level 
or flagship and does not compromise on any features whatsoever. Last but definitely not the least, I ditched Chrome on my Windows PC for Microsoft Edge, so it only makes sense to use Edge on my Android device as well, right? Microsoft Edge offers seamless sync across all your Edge browsers and just like the desktop version, the Android app does not use a lot of your resources. Now the sync includes your passwords, bookmarks and history. This also uses Chromium as a base but is very lightweight and functional and the UI here is quite simple to use too. You also get the collections feature here which in my opinion is so much better than normal bookmarking. Along with that, there's a good ad blocker coupled with an immersive reader mode that lets users remove distracting content from the websites that they're browsing. And well, that was it. As always, you can find the download links to all of the apps that I talked about down in the description box. And if you found this video helpful, make sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more awesome tech content. Till then, this is one from Guiding Tech and I'll see you in the next one.